Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. The only way to possibly hear your baby's heartbeat at home more accurately is to use the same type of fetal Doppler monitor your practitioner uses. And over-the-counter versions of that kind of handheld ultrasound device cost several hundred dollars. Make your mark, take our lead. There is no evidence these apps are reliable. One lady was using the app to listen to the fetal heartbeat because the baby had not been moving and she had been partially reassured the baby was okay, she said. In both cases the women were given a false sense of security. Make your mark, take our lead. You might start to feel your baby moving, often called, quickening, around 18 weeks into your pregnancy. If this is your first pregnancy, it might not happen until about 20 weeks. However, by the second pregnancy, you might notice the telltale signs as early as 16 weeks. Make your mark, take our lead. Symptoms are things you feel yourself that others can't see, like having a sore throat or feeling dizzy. The most common symptom of stillbirth is when you stop feeling your baby moving and kicking. Others include cramps, pain or bleeding from the vagina. Take our lead. One of the simplest ways to listen to your baby's heartbeat is by using a stethoscope. A good quality stethoscope will be able to help you hear the fetal heartbeat around 18 to 20 weeks. Around this time your baby's heartbeat will be strong enough for you to hear with a stethoscope. Thank you for watching, please subscribe and hit the bell notification.